News 13's Larry Barker first exposed the UNM expedition to find Bigfoot back in October, a foray into the forest paid for by you. Now a lawmaker wants to make it illegal for New Mexico taxpayers to fund colleges to go hunting for mythical creatures. News 13's Madeline Schmidt is live at the Roundhouse in Santa Fe with that story. Madeline? Yeah, the uh, Dean, the bill comes from Sen a Senator from Gallup, who Larry Barker spoke with during his investigation. The bill would stop trips like the one Dr. Christopher Dyer of the UNM Gallup campus took last year. There was a field trip, and taxpayers paid for that. Mm -hmm. So if you went dollars. to the Sandias to look for Bigfoot, mm -hmm. right? We took one day and we went up there, yeah, walked around. Did you see Bigfoot? No, but we looked at habitat. <laughs> we didn't see it. That trip for Dr. Dyer and his friends cost taxpayers more than $7,000 in hotel rooms, meals, and mileage costs. In response to what happened, Senator George Munoz is sponsoring a bill that would ban public funds from being spent on, quote, looking for or catching a fictitious creature. It's sad that we have to do this, that they don't have the ethics. UNM doesn't have the ethics to, to stop this. Um, so now we have to draft bills to stop something that we know is not morally right. The senator had a little bit of fun drafting this bill. It also bans publicly funded searches for Pokemon, leprechauns, and even the boogeyman. Now, Senator Munoz says what Dr. Dyer did was unfair to students. They pay a lot of money to go to school, and it should not be spent on this. Back to you. Hi, right, Madeline. Thank you. Outgoing UNM President Bob Frank previously told News 13 that the Bigfoot expedition was inappropriate and would not happen again.